Hi, it's Denise. Welcome to my home. Oh my goodness, another late video. I'm so sorry I didn't get this out sooner for a lot of reasons. <laughs> my day has just been really, really long and lots of things going on. How are you? Well, it's like dinner time. It's 10 after 6. And if I'm not disturbing your meal, come and sit with me. If you eat your, eat your dinner on your own, come sit with me. Get a TV tray and come sit with me. Um, we have a TV haul. Now, remember I told you a few days ago that I was going to have a, a clothing haul. This is it. Uh, there are quite a few pieces, and there are a few other things as well. Um, but I thought I would go ahead and do this. I'm, um, oh goodness. That just went out of my head. Can't think. Um, anyhow, that's what we're going to do. So, <laughs> I knew it wasn't going to take long. Huh? Yeah. His little tail's just wagging like crazy. Sweet puppy. I hope you've had a good day. I went to the doctor this morning. Everything is fine. I just go every few months to this particular doctor. I have a pain pump. And um, he has to make sure that everything is okay with it. So, I really like him. He's a good guy. And I look forward to seeing him. He's got two beautiful little girls and just a real personable kind of guy. Um, so that took half the day. My appointment was at 930, but I didn't get home until afternoon. It goes that way, you know. I'm really, really grateful that there are rides uh, and you have to wait. So, half my day was there, then I had, <laughs> I had to make up to my dogs for being gone, huh? <laughs> you make me laugh all the time, you do, you're such a delight, even when you pee on my furniture, I'll keep you. Um. If you're new to this channel, welcome. As you can see, it's not too formal. We do things. We make things. We talk a lot, or I talk a lot, you listen a lot. Um, I have animals, and you'll see all of them from time to time. This one a lot. He's just kind of connected to my hip. But if you're new to this channel, welcome. You are so welcome here. This is the most wonderful channel, the most wonderful group of people I have ever known. I am so blessed to be here with you all. Um, and you might really feel like this is where you want to be. And if you do, I would invite you to subscribe. I'd invite you to comment and I'd invite you to like the channel. All of those things are really important to us. Uh, you can always just tune in, but you know, if you subscribe and hit the bell, you'll get uh, notifications when the videos come up. I post most every day, uh, at least something. I um, do videos every day. So it'll tell you when it's up. And I can't tell you that I'm early in the day or late in the day or middle of the day because it varies. So if you subscribe, you'll just get to know, right? Good idea. Liking our channel, is it, it's a wonderful thing to do. And it's so easy to do. You just like it. Hit the like button. Uh, YouTube uses that, you know, in their analytics. And it's... Uh, they want to see what kind of traffic you have on your channel. And the comments are real important, too. 
The comments are important to me because I get to know you. I get to know who you are. And that's really important to me. We, we're just important to each other. And if you're new to Timu, which most people aren't anymore. Most people know what Timu is. Um, it's an online shopping platform. Kind of like the ones we have here, but kind of like not. Uh, the prices are great. They're 50 to 75% less than the marketplace. Um, they absorb the shipping on the things that are, are shipped from Timu. There are some subsidiaries or like satellites. They, they have places here in the United States now too that you have to have a certain amount, like $30. You order $30 from that particular vendor and they pay the shipping. It's still really, really low though. The shipping on an order is like $2.99. So it's not bad. And the prices are still really good. Uh, and also, you know, the Timu things are still there. And that's free shipping at this point. Um, they don't have middlemen involved. So there's no price regulation. When you see, uh, there are tons of stores that they have, uh, vendors. I'm not sure how many, but you know, as many people as they serve, there's bound to be a whole bunch of them. And they control their own pricing. So when you put something in your cart at one price, it may go up or down at any given moment. The only time when that stops is when you put your money on the order. Now, that doesn't mean that that's what you're going to end up paying for it. Uh, it won't go up anymore. But they, they have implemented what's called a price adjustment. And that price adjustment comes into play when a price that you have agreed to pay or you have paid goes down. They offer you a price adjustment. You accept it and you will get an amount of money to equalize the difference. So you're getting the very best price that you can. And this is for 30 days after you buy your products. They can be still at Timu, not shipped yet. They can be in, in transit. They can be in your home. Uh, for 30 days, you're eligible for price adjustments. Sometimes they're just a few pennies, but other times they're pretty healthy. I think the largest price adjustment, individual price adjustment I've gotten has been about $5. Um, but you know, any penny, any bit helps, doesn't it? It can either go back to your original source of payment or Timu credit. And I would suggest Timu credit. You have access to that money right away. Uh, and you can use it on subsequent orders. So your next order, if it's a, if you have $10 in credit and your order is $80, you only have to pay 70 for it. So that's pretty cool. Timo has games that you can play. Uh, they're Fishland and Farmland. You can win them. Uh, it takes a minute, but you can. I'll have my codes in the description box so that you can go there and start your farm and your fish land and have me there with you to give you food and water. And you can give me food and water too. Pretty cool. Um, if you're a brand new customer, don't do anything yet. Go to the website, go to timu.com. Look at what they have. See if what I'm saying isn't true. You know, you can pick out stuff that you like. Um, go to your vendors that you generally use. Look it up. See if what I'm saying isn't true. I think you'll be pleased. Uh, I've done a couple of videos where I do price um, comparisons with Amazon and across the board, it's a lot less, a whole lot less. So it's worth doing and it's for the same products. Now, when you have an idea of what it is that you want to buy and you've written it down, because I know that you will, you'll know, make a list. Um, then you can go into my description box and you'll see this code that I'll put right here. That's my affiliate code that will you'll use for all of your orders, not just for your first order. So you keep that code and know that you're going to be using it. 
um, go into my, my description box and there'll be a, a download link for new customers. You download that app and it's going to invite you to be an affiliate and it kind of slaps you in the face when you open it up. And I've had people say, I don't want to be an affiliate. Well, you don't have to be. Just scroll down and then you can start your order. Also, put that in the search bar at the top of the page, put my affiliate code in there. Now you have an hour to shop. That's why I'm, I'm suggesting that you go to the website first. So you have an idea of what you want and you can look it up and you can get it and get it quickly. Uh, you have an hour after you download the app to shop for your first order for the benefits that you get. And the benefit that you get, there are two. One is a 30% discount on your first order. That's a lot. They're already really low prices. And when you pay for your order, you will be awarded a $100 coupon bundle to be used on subsequent orders. What a great way to start your shopping experience with Timo. I think it's really great. Customer service is good. Uh, 90 day, 90 day return policy, no questions asked. It could be for any reason whatsoever. Uh, 30 days price adjustment, 90 days um, return for refund. And that could be returned to your source of payment or to team of credit also. Uh, goodness, let's see. What else can I tell you? I think you'll have a good time. And you get really good products. That makes a whole big difference, doesn't it? Well, remember, as a new customer, I'll be showing you again um, how to do that. Also, I wanted to mention to returning customers, be sure and use my affiliate code in the search bar with every order that you make. It makes a huge difference. I'm getting another sponsored haul this month, so it is making a difference. Uh, a sponsored haul is where Timu provides a certain amount of money. It's not very much. It's about $30. But it's $30 that I don't have to spend out of my own pocket. And I get to pick out products of a certain uh, campaign. So there's a theme behind it. And then I get the products and I get to show them to you. Um, that's really fun. So that's what happens when you use my affiliate code. Also, uh, there will be commission up the road. Not a lot. But there again, every little bit helps. And it goes all back into the channel. You know, I get to order more stuff to show you. And that's what my goal is, is to be able to serve you. Also, I wanted to remind you about a search tool. When you go into Timu, you're going to hit a product that you like, and it brings up the picture. Click on that picture. Up in the upper right hand corner, you'll see a camera. Click on the camera. And what that will do is bring up every vendor that has that product. And you can find the very lowest price. Uh, sometimes the one that you're shown is the lowest, but other times it's not. So that's a really nice thing to be able to do. So click on the picture, click on the camera, and go to town. Okay, well, I think we're about ready. I wanted to give you an update on Lacey. She is still in ICU. They have her, you know, it was a pretty big surgery. Uh, they had to crack her chest. Um, her mama told me today that they did lose her and they had to bring her back. So what you're seeing is an absolute miracle, absolute. 
she'll be in there for a while and uh, the outcome I'm not sure you know what that's gonna look like but I'll keep you guys informed and please 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 continue to pray prayer works you see it work We've been able to support one of our own and I really really appreciate that about you all there's been such an outpouring of love and prayers thank you so much okay so we have a clothing haul are you ready let's see first things I have Now I want you to know that when I got these in the bag, all the clothes were stuffed in one bag and they didn't have their own little bags. That's the first time that's happened. So I got little bags and put everything in them so that I would open them. I thought that was kind of cool. First thing I found were these shirts. Now these are soft t-shirt material. Uh, I really love the fabric. It's got a round neck. It's a t-shirt design. The applique on there is good, I think. And it says, with God, all things are possible. And we've seen that, haven't we? I ended up getting two. Now I paid very little two dollars and 98 cents a piece for these where do you get a t-shirt for that I don't know if you got on there right now I just priced these today you can get it for 297 and all the sizes are available team who makes their clothing very well this has uh, a short sleeve All of the stitching is wonderful. They've got double stitching around the neck. Everything that needs to be done that you see in fine clothes is done with clothes at Timu. I sew, so I look for stuff like this. You find seams that are well done. They're not raw edges. There are no hanging threads. I've only had in all of the clothes and you know I've bought a lot of clothes. All of the clothes, I've had three that have had any hanging strings. And the only thing I needed to do is just cut them. It wasn't an issue with the clothing. Now this is 100% polyester. And a lot of times the shirts that are 100% polyester don't feel like t-shirts. But these do. Uh, there's give in it. Now you don't bleach polyester. So when you wash this, wash it inside out, tumble dry it low, and it'll stay nice for a long, long time. The second shirt is just like it. I think it's even the same size. I made a mistake. And you know what? They're never mistakes because the people that you get give them to really appreciate it. I like this. It has a little leopard print on the letters. And these are long t-shirts. Look how long they are. So they would go down past your hips. The next thing I have for you is a dress, a very pretty dress. Now this particular dress is out of stock, but I found one very similar. So I'm going to use that as an example price wise. And then the picture that I show you will be of that particular dress. I paid 807 for this. 
And the dress that I chose that's similar is $11.69. This is a really pretty dress. Now it's 100% polyester and it has, if I can hold it up here, it has the smocking at the midriff. This is all stretchy. I really like this look. It's so pretty. And it's got big puffy sleeves for my big flowy arms. The print is pretty. The replacement dress that I found, it's a print almost like this, except it's black. It's not blue. Now, there's a ruffle here. This is, the midriff comes below the bust line. It's not to the waist. There's a ruffle here and a ruffle here, and the dress is a maxi dress. It will probably go, for me, it'll go down to my ankles, where a maxi dress for someone with a little height, it would go between the knees and the ankles. It's got a big flowy skirt. I would wear this anywhere. It's just so pretty. And it's lightweight. It'll be beautiful for summertime. And when it gets cooler, you know, put on a, a slip underneath it. And you can wear it even when it's cooler. That's one of the advantages of Timu clothing. Uh, there are items of clothing that do have lining. But they, most of them do not. And the advantage with that is just as I told you. You can wear a slip. And you have a full, fully functioning wardrobe for summer and winter. This is so pretty. This dress. Now, this one is out of stock also, but I found one almost identical to it. I paid $6.69 for it, and it's $13.98. Now, why did I get it so cheap, you ask? One of the things that I do is I'll go in and look for clearance, and I buy a lot of clearance clothes. If you put in the search bar, clearance women's dresses, and then when that comes up, you're going to see underneath that, it's going to say sort by, S-O-R-T by. You click on that and it says several different things. But what I go into is um, sort by lowest price to highest price. Now, when that first comes up, you're going to see all kinds of um, lingerie and things like that that you might not be interested in. Um but keep scrolling because you'll find that the dresses that are on clearance, it's just such a wonderful deal. Just like this one. Now this has, is it a shirt waist? I, I don't remember what they call it, but it's the smocking at the waist, just like the other dress. And it has a crisscross collar. It has bell sleeves. I love these sleeves. Now this is see-through and it has a slip. They, they did the lining. On the top, you'll need to wear a camisole. Can you see the uh, design? The fabric has such a pretty design. And I honestly don't know for sure if the one that I found you has the same design. I think it might be a dotted Swiss, if I'm, I'm not mistaken. Now this is a ivory off-white, and it's a long dress. The slip comes down to your knees. It's not a full slip. And if you want a full slip, you can certainly wear one underneath it. 
But this is the summer look. The slip that's underneath. is 100% polyester. And I think that that's probably what the whole dress is, is 100% polyester. I'm not seeing another tag. So that's the tag for the dress. Isn't this pretty? It's just so dainty and so pretty. Oh, I thought there was ink or something on it. It's just a thread, a red thread. It's very flowy. You never see how flowy fabric is until you wash it. And I generally wash everything before I try it on. That's not because of where it came from or anything else. It has to do with um, taking the sizing out of the clothes. The sizing helps to keep the fabric in a more stable state. And once it's washed, then you can see how flowy it's going to be. And this is already flowy. It has a lettuce edge on the bottom, so you don't have a hem showing. It's so pretty. Okay. Oh my goodness. What have you been doing these spring days? Today was a cold one. The wind was blowing. Not blowing. It was breezy. And when it's breezy at this time of year, it is biting cold, even though it's spring. So that was not my favorite thing. But the sun was shining. It was beautiful. And you get to see all the pretty green and the blossoms. The blossoms on my tree and are gone. I have a early blooming. It's like a um, a weeping willow, but it's a blossoming tree, and it weeps. And it oh, it's so pretty. It has pink pink blossoms. Now this dress, it's just kind of a real basic dress. I paid $5.11 for it, and it is also discontinued. These were, a lot of them were, were um, clearance. I did find one that was similar for $10.79. Still a great price. I would couple this with black and I would wear a shrug with it because the sleeves are not very long but that's my issue not everybody has that issue I might be surprised but I don't think so when I saw it in the catalog or in the uh, on the web in the app come on Denise it looked like the sleeves were longer than this And that's okay. I can wear a little shrug with it. It's an A-line dress. The design is very simple. It does go down below your knees. And if you're of the mind to wear a belt with it, it would be beautiful. This is one that you can dress up or down very, very easily. I love the color. It's kind of a peach color. And this is the polyester that has the white on the inside. It's it's very flowy, but it's not as flowy as the, the non-white polyester. And I think this might have some spandex in it. Let me see. Ninety five percent polyester and five percent spandex. So it gives you a lot of latitude, a lot of give. 
see. So it's forgiving. It's a good thing because I my body needs a lot of forgiveness. Peyton went to her friends tonight. She'll be gone until tomorrow. So I'll have some fun getting things done. I end up at the table doing jewelry a lot. It takes me a long time to do it, but I really enjoy it so much. This is a pair of pajamas. I can't remember when the last time was I bought a pair of pajamas. I bought a, uh, a sleep dress from Timu, and that was really comfy. But this is a pair of pajamas, tops and bottoms, $5.27, and they're only $4.47 now. I had heard that Timu had really nice jammies, and I thought, you know, I want to see. And this has little bears on it. It's really cute. And it's probably got spandex in it. It's stretchy. It has the white polyester. It's soft. Um, da -da 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 -da. Yep. It's a last stain though. Same, same. It has different, it has wash with light colors, machine wash warm or cold, gentle cycle, do not bleach, tumble dry low, low iron if needed. I don't think I'm going to iron my pajamas. What a fun lounging outfit. Now this is the top. It has like a boat neck. And the sleeves are generous, so it's not going to bind. I like that. And these are the pants. Pants are the same fabric. They have an elasticized waist. And the legs are um, the legs are pretty pretty wide. So these will be really comfy. Kind of folds into itself. Whoops. I like the bears. When Manda, Peyton's mom, was young, little girl, I found some border. We lived in a rental and I couldn't wallpaper or paint, but I found this border and it was called Amanda's Choice. And I tacked it up there with tacks. And it was so pretty. It had lots of little bears and toys and they were on a shelf and just putting that in her room just personalized it so much I remember those days with with lots of smiles and sometimes tears it's got a nice elasticized waist it's not a um a waistband that'll roll. It's sewn in well. So I got my Timu jammies. And four dollars and forty nine cents for a pair of pajamas, two pieces. That's pretty good, don't you think? I think so. Now, I got price adjustments on this order, so I, I suspect that that $4.49 is a more accurate price for me than the, the 
27 However, $5 for a pair of pajamas. Goodness. Great price. What is going on here? This? Okay. Now, let me see. I'm going to do this first. This is a wig for Peyton. And it's definitely for Peyton. It's pink and black. And it's very long. One of her figures or one of her um, people that she looks at. I don't even want to say that because she doesn't watch those kinds of cartoons or anything anymore. But she likes this look. And I think it's really cute. I did her hair pink and black. It was different. This is half and half. And hers was, when I did her hair, I did pink in the front and then on the underneath and then black. This will give her a chance to vary without having to di dig in all the, the dye and stuff. And you know, it's a really good quality wig. The hair is nice. I think it's good quality. It's got a nice wig cap. I wonder if it adjusts like mine do. It has elastic. Yeah. See, there is uh, on the inside, there's this elastic little piece with a a hook on it and you can hook it in in the back it has fabric that's sewn down to receive these little hooks so depending on the size of your head you might need to make the wig cap a little smaller I'm glad it has that I use mine a lot Last wig I got her, she never wore, so we'll see if she wears this one. She said she would. She wants to do it up with uh, ponytails on each side. It's very long. Should I wear it? I don't think so. She was excited, though, and wanted me to haul it. This is not an order. It's an order, but it's not in the order that it was received. There are a couple things in here that are from a recent order that I haven't hauled yet. And they're hers. So, let me see here. I'm thinking I forgot to put down the price of her wig. No. I think that I paid eight or seven for it and that's eleven sixty nine now. This was written on here. Somehow that just doesn't seem right. I think I paid a little more than that. I think it was about twelve dollars. I will post it. When I do the video, I'll put it up there so you can see how much it was. I don't know why I didn't get the price on this one. I forgot. The 
package them well. You know, they're in a net. I don't think this one had a wig cap. They usually do. But this did not. This doesn't have the price on it either. He thinks not. Pink and black color. 24 inch hair. That's a little different than the four inch hairs that I get. Uh, uh. Okay. I ordered a couple of my wigs. And you know what? There have been those of you that have been really interested in this wig. And I found the links and everything. And at one point they were discontinued and then they came up again. And now they're discontinued again. I don't know what to say about it. I'll keep my eyes open. And they came back. It was the same vendor though. You know, I don't understand why they do that. I can see them saying that it was out of stock. But now these were $8.99. And I know they're out of stock. And usually I don't show things that I, I can't put a replacement on. I have looked for wigs to replace this one. Because it's just, this wig is just, so unique and I think it's just me and the way it works for me same same the part is good everything is good in this when you first get it it's kind of smushed at the top with any wig and you need to, to brush it down But this also has, and the wig cap, it has the adjusters. I'm so disappointed. I'm sorry. I don't understand. I mean, I bought myself of this particular wig. I think I bought five of them. So I'll have them. It's just, you know, when you see them and you like them and I can't provide you with a doable response, it really concerns me a lot. Let's see, the other one is, there. you know, just little tiny differences in the wigs. Not very much, though. I'll probably wear one of the other ones tomorrow so you can see it. I need to get them all together. This one is due for a shampoo. You know, you wash a wig about as often as you wash your hair. Anyway, I do. When you get outside and you brush it and I don't put hairspray on my wigs. I suppose you could. There's special spray to use. The non-alcohol spray is what I've been told. You don't want to have alcohol in it. Um, now this one looks like it's whiter. A little bit whiter in the front. Whiter color wise. That would be interesting. They're four inches. So if you're looking for a wig that's similar, it's a four inch wig and it's a gradient color. 
and I'm sorry. I, I, I'm going to put a wig up that I found that kind of reminds me of it, but you know, I've bought a bunch of them thinking that I could replace this and I haven't been able to find one and don't give up because you and I are different and what looks good on me doesn't necessarily look good on someone else and vice versa. So you will find a wig that you enjoy. Don't be afraid. They're not that expensive and it gives you an opportunity to test them out. You can always return them if you don't want it. And quite honestly, I've never had to return a wig because they can't resell them. Um, and basically the reasons that I give are the honest reasons that it doesn't look like the model. Um, and it doesn't work for me. So I would never lie or anything like that. You don't have to. You never have to lie. But, you, don't, you know, telling them what's going on, customer service is really good about that. I'm stumbling over my words. These have the wig caps in there, and I don't wear a wig cap because I have, now they call this a wig cap liner. It's a stretch fabric. Let's see what it looks like. I haven't even opened one. I had scissors. What did I do with them? My, I don't have very much hair. So I don't have a need to wear a wig cap where someone that's wearing a wig just for fun for a change, um, might need to wear a wig cap because you gotta do something with your hair. I just keep mine very short and it's gray anyway, so if it shows, it, it's not a big deal. This is what they look like. And they are really stretchy. Oh, there's a hole in it. Why is there a hole in it? I wonder if it's supposed to be there. I don't know. Let's see what the other one looks like. Let's look. Do any of you do diamond painting? That's something I haven't done. I'm not saying I wouldn't, but it's not something that I really have gotten into. However, star at starlight. Now this one has a hole in it too. I guess it's just at the top. Starlight is her channel and she does diamond paintings and Timu Halls. Just a delight. You'll enjoy her a lot. Her name is Star and I think you'll really enjoy her channel. She's very, very sweet and just delightful. They're the same. So I guess when you put them on it doesn't matter if the top has cover on it or not. I don't know. I suppose that's right.
Oh, there's nothing else in this bag. There's a bag. There's bags in this bag. How'd that happen? Okay. This is something I got for Peyton. And I paid $8.58 for it. And it's now $5.85 for a hoodie. $5.85. I don't think you can get them at Goodwill. And they're used at Goodwill. She saw this. And it was at a different um, online vendor that we used to use before Timu came along. And it was really expensive. And I, I have tried to show her, you know, just because it's there doesn't mean you have to get it. You, you need to look for prices. This has the, the fleece on the inside. I'm thinking that this hoodie at the other vendor was, was 20 bucks. It's a nice, soft, heavy-ish Spider-Man hoodie. It's a zip-up hoodie. It's obviously red, and it does come in the black also. It has the cuff sleeves. And I really like that it's fleecy on the inside. It's a sweatshirt. Sometimes you get items that are designed like sweatshirts, but they're not. They're t-shirts. This is a hoodie. This is a, a sweatshirt hoodie. It looks really cute on her. And they're cut gener they're a generous cut. This is a medium. And she wears it. There's a lot of, of movement in this. She she could possibly wear a small, but she doesn't want one. She likes to have a bigger. And with that being said, um, these are cut bigger. So she likes it. And it is it's a medium. The applique is good. It is real plasticky. It almost feels like it was painted on. I would wash this inside out, absolutely. And, you know, just be careful. You don't want to dry it hot. You know, sometimes this kind of feels like the applique that might stick together when it gets too hot. So be careful of that. Oh, there's got to be a fabric content in here. Well, it looks like oh, that little stinker, she pulled the tag out. I will look it up and post it on the video, what the content is. I expect it's polyester. What did I say the price was on this? It's a test. And I failed. I don't remember. $8.58 is what I paid for it. And it price adjusted down to $5.85 for a hoodie. And it's one that has stuff on it. It's really nice. I think the rest of the things here are hers. These are knee-high tennis shoes. She loves them. 
and they were also at the other store and they were over thirty dollars and i said well let's just take a look and of course timu is cheaper or less expensive more reasonable and these were price adjusted also um, i paid I don't know. I think it was my cat. I'm sorry. Hold on. You see all my mess. Okay, let's see if we can do this. The cat went behind my chair and I think she pulled the uh, cord. I had the phone plugged in. Can't seem to get a video without damage. Okay. Uh, let's try this again. Or still. I'm so sorry. At these little boots. I paid. That's wrong. Twenty six ninety eight for these boots, and they were um, price adjusted down to twenty three. So this is a really, really good deal on, on these little tennis shoes. Okay, here's another bag with a bunch of stuff in it. So it isn't all just hers. I thought there was more, but I didn't see the bag. It took dropping you on the floor to see everything I needed to see. Okay, this is a really pretty dress. I don't want to edit it. I'm afraid I'm going to mess it up if I edit it. I don't want you to see something that isn't good though. Okay. This is a really pretty dress. And I took it out of the bag and didn't look at the price. I think that flustered me more than I thought. I paid $8.07 for it and it's $11.69 now. It's really pretty. This is a, um, there is a top to this. Where did it go? Here it is. This is pretty much a, a just an A-line dress that has, Ginger, be careful. It goes down to the waist, but it's a, um, I don't know what you call it. It does have a definition at the waist, but it's full. It's not um, cinched. It has a round neck. And it has a long skirt. There's no ruffles on it. I love the print. Isn't it pretty? So it's just a real flowy, pretty, soft, green-ish. It has green, the background is a greenish beige, and then it has green and then peach colored flowers, short sleeves, 
And I think the fiber content will surprise me. I think it might be cotton. It's 100% cotton. So, I know that most, most of the time clothes are um, pre-washed, pre-shrunk. I probably won't trust that. And I'll wash it and hang it. Ginger, what? What, baby? I think you already pulled the camera down. What can I do for you? This is Ginger. You can see her tail. Maybe you can see her face a little bit. This is my shy girl. She and two of her siblings were left in a box by my, uh, the last house I lived in before I moved here it was a trailer. And they didn't even have their eyes open yet. She, obviously we bottle fed them. There was one little boy and two girls. The boy was beautiful, long hair, just a beautiful orange tabby like her. Uh, but he was more of a, a red, red, red. And they all got a bacterial infection. I was able to get the girls out of it, but... I don't think he survived. I took him to Animal Protection League because they said that they would treat him. I never called back to find out because I don't know if I wanted to find out. Uh, but she's my baby. As an adult, she used to suck on my fingers. She doesn't do that anymore. But she is five years old now. Very sweet. Her sister was Calico. And she got out one day and didn't come back. She was spayed and stuff. She didn't wander away. I think somebody might have picked her up because she was so pretty. I would hope so. I would hope that someone picked her up, that nothing bad happened to her. I do everything I can do to keep my kitties inside because it's not safe out there. She's an unusual kitty that, um, like calicos are, I don't know if there's even um, a history of male calicos. It's my understanding that they just aren't. Um, calicos are all female. Now there, there's a real small chance that you can have an orange female tabby like her, but it's very uncommon. So she's an unusual girl, aren't you? She has a very noble, beautiful face. And she usually hides out. So I'm kind of glad she's out here. And as soon as I stop petting her, she'll get down and go away. Unfortunately. Yeah, I knew it. She got her lovins and that was it. This is a really cute little dress. Uh, I paid $7.98 for it. It's $6.69 now. And it is short, and I will wear it with shorts. I think. Isn't that cute? It has... Oh, half sleeves, and there's a little cuff on them. And the front is a crisscross front. And it's probably a raised waist. I'm not sure. And it's not, I'm not 
feeling elastic in it, but it's a generous waist or not a waist. And it has a little ruffle. And I don't know. I'm thinking that this might just come down to my knees. I'm not sure. If it does, I'll wear it as a dress. If not, I have some green shorts that are the same color as this. And I'll just wear it with shorts. I think it's so pretty. It has like a jungle print almost on it. It's not, but I when I look at these colors, I think of jungle. It's got uh, leaves on it that are leopard, or, uh, the spots like a leopard, and green leaves. And I'll show you this side. I just love the colors. You know, this seems to have the same kind of a um, gathering that I really like where it's gathered up underneath the bust. It kind of goes up into a, a V underneath. Like that. It's really flattering, I think. Very, very reasonable. And I think it's awfully cute. We'll see when I do try-ons, huh? Okay. I got this belt for Peyton. And the belt was $447. And I think it's like $449 now. It's the same price. It's a fun belt. She's a little bitty, and I ended up putting a, an extra hole in this one as well as the other one that I got. Belts are expensive. But with that being said, I mean, 447 for a belt is nothing. And it's the pink and black that she seems to be gravitating towards and I want to really encourage that because it isn't just black and this is number last this is a little tank top I paid $3.95 for it and it's $3.95 now. $3.95. It's really cute. It is a little crop crappie top. It's not a real low cut one though, or a it's not low cut or high cut. It's not as high cut. As some of the crop tops are. It goes almost to her waist. It has stars on it. And the background is gray. This is a polyester, I do believe. Tag, tag, where are you? 95% polyester, 5% spandex. So I've gotten her quite a few clothes here lately. I am going to be uh, buying her more clothes next month. Her 16th birthday is coming. I can't believe that. She's been with me since she was 12. Just before her 13th birthday. So, that was our clothing haul and a little extra. 
What was your favorite thing? And I hope it wasn't the floor when you fell. No, I'm sure it wasn't. I'm excited to get things for Peyton. I couldn't really buy for her before because she just, there was nothing she wanted. I guess I can show you this because it's Timu stuff. It's not Timu made. I made it. And then the earrings. I made the bracelet and I tied it and I didn't tie the right knot and it came undone. So I, I need to, I'm about halfway done with remaking it. I didn't want to make it before the video. Um, I'm having a really fun time with all the Timu beads and all the accessories to make jewelry. I've made a lot of it so far. Well, I can't say it's a lot, but quite a few pieces. And I think they're really kind of pretty. This has a hangy down. And I think that looks pretty with this dress, which is a Timu dress. Well, did you enjoy the video? If you've enjoyed the content and you haven't subscribed, I would invite you to subscribe. I'd invite you to comment and I invite you to like this video. I enjoy so much having you here. I feel like I've had my, my friends at my house and we just kind of had a tea party or a coffee party, coffee clutch. I don't know. I've just enjoyed it a lot. I even enjoyed the fall because I got to pick you up. <laughs> I know that's kind of crazy, huh? I'm always doing weird stuff on the videos. I don't know that I've even put out one video that was perfect. And you still love me anyway, right? I'm so blessed. I really, really am. Remember, if you're new to Timu, I'm going to put my affiliate code up here again. And go into the, just go to the website, get your stuff going, check with the other vendors and see what their prices look like. Then when you're ready to place an order, go into my description box, download the app, Put my, my affiliate code in the, the, I'm sorry, into the search bar. And you're going to enjoy a 30% discount on your first order and a $100 coupon bundle. And everything else will be itemized there in the description box. I will also have order links to the orders where these items were. Uh, if it doesn't work, sometimes I can download them and sometimes I can't. Um, if it doesn't, then I'll make a notation there that you can get back to me with an item if you're interested in it and I'll find it for you. Uh, and I'll have my game codes in there for you. So take a look at the description box and you'll see what you need to see in order to do that stuff. I love you all very much, and until next time.